I fly halfway around the world and an odd note is waiting for me in my hotel room. It says to come to the bridge down by the river. This looks like the place. I could really go for some Wiener Schnitzel after the long walk out here. Are you a victim of the inferior American social support system? Uh, I need some whiskey. Sober up, sir. I'm glad Chuck is dead. Ruined my life. Wake up, sir. Wake up, sir. Wake up, sir. I have to go. Sleep well. I have to go. Sleep well. Wrestle Trail to Thimbleweed Park, 1.7 miles. I had better follow the instructions on the note before wandering into the underbrush. Step three of the note. Now for step four. So tell me again why you're here. I was assigned to the case by the home office in Albuquerque. There is no home office in Albuquerque. It's neat to know. Look, I like working a case alone. I especially don't need some junior agent messing up my investigation. Especially some junior agent that thinks I don't know there isn't a home office in Albuquerque. So stay out of my way. Take a lot of notes, sit back and learn, and I'll wrap up this case and we can both get the hell out of here. Your reputation certainly precedes you, Agent Ray. I'll take that as a compliment, Agent Ray is. It's how it was intended. I'm sure it was. Let's photograph the victim and head into town to talk to the local sheriff. The body is starting to pixelate. Body starting to pixelate. This is going to be a long night. Detective Antonio Reyes, junior agent. It's definitely my badge.
It's an instant camera, but there's no film in it. Happy to help. Smile. Now we can head into town and find the local sheriff. Dead ringer for the body. Oh. It's an empty whiskey bottle. Appears to be a male, approximately 40 years old. Looks like he's been in the water for 24 hours. You can tell by the pixelation around the nose and neck. Let's see here. There's no wallet in his pockets. But I found a card. Possibly a key card from a hotel. It's covered by the underbrush, but it's an old abandoned chainsaw. Fool me once, shame on me. Fool me twice. It's pretty rusty and totally out of chainsaw gas. Definitely not the murder weapon. No missing body parts. What was that? Fight that old tree is blocking the great entrance. The trail ends here, at this huge rock wall. There are signs of a struggle here. This is clearly a drag mark. The victim was obviously knocked out here, then dragged over to the stream. I don't see any blood, so I think he was actually killed in the water. It's an empty can of Crockford's tuna heads, the good parts. Still has that, I don't see anything up ahead. I think the town must be in the other direction. It's the ET game for the 2600.
It's a circus flyer with a crazy looking clown on it. Hmm, pretty good makeup though. Signals are very strong tonight. Why are you dressed like a giant pigeon? We're the Pigeon Brothers Plumbing. I'm Beth. That's my sister Emily. Hi there! But remember, signals are very strong tonight. Why brothers if you're sisters? Dad was expecting to have sons, and he was too cheap to have the van repainted. So we're just rolling with it till he's dead. Oh, soon. Shut up, Emily. Signals are very strong tonight. What signals? The signals. Signals are very strong tonight. Yes, you already said that, but what signals? <laughs> I'm just screwing with you. Dark night. Deserted road. Me in a giant pigeon costume? It was too good to pass up. But the signals are strong tonight. Very strong. This is really odd. Should I save my game? I wouldn't worry about it. The game was expertly designed to have no dead ends or death. Yet still be scary and have a sense of tension. You can feel safe exploring whatever you want. But I'd watch out for the signals. They can be very strong and disrupt the power grid. But playing classic adventure games has taught me to save often. <laughs> that was true, up until Monkey Island. At least with LucasArts style adventures. Then the designers realized that death and dead ends weren't making the game more enjoyable. It was actually making it less fun. That seems like a sensible approach to adventure game design. It is. It just takes a little longer and requires more thought and planning. <laughs> but it really pays off in the end. You almost ran over a federal agent. That is a felony. Sorry about that. Like I said, the signals are very strong tonight. Do you know anything about the body by the bridge? Why is it whenever a dead body is found, suspicion always falls to the person dressed as a giant bird? It's in the cadet training manual. We don't know anything about a dead body, but the signals are strong tonight. Very strong. Nice chatting with you. I need to find the sheriff and solve a murder. Nice talking to you, too. Eek! Was Whack! Beep! Whack! Beep! No time to talk. We need to figure out the signals! Nuts! I could really go for some salted nuts right about now. Beep! Squee! Click, click, click! Eek! Eek! Click, 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 click! Boop! Beep! Eek! Was. It's a plumbing van? Driven by big pigeons? Boop. No need. The perps are outside. Whack! Beep! Flowers left over from a funeral.
The heavy wrought iron gate is closed. I see a switch inside. I can't put it in there. Uh, no thanks. I'd better hold on to this until later. I shouldn't say anything out loud, but... Seeing Chuck's tomb in person makes me a little happy inside. It's an empty soda bottle. Five cent deposit in Massachusetts, Hawaii, California, Ark. Wait up, eager beaver. Willie's Watch and Violin Repair Shop. Thimbleweed County's most exclusive watch and violin repair. We repair watches and violins for the rich or famous. It says, need help playing Thimbleweed Park? Call the fully automated Hinttron 3000 I'm the Thimbleweed Park Sheriff. I don't remember calling the Federinos. That's what you are, Feds. Hard to miss the government issue suits. <laughs> I'm Agent Reyes, and this is my partner, Agent Ray. Nice to meet you, Agent Arenos. Looks like you heard about our little murder Reno out by the bridge, huh? There is nothing little about murder, sir. <sighs> Ignore him. He's new. No sense in wasting everyone's time, Reno. This cutscene is certain to get long, and it's only gonna get longer. Let's find the coroner and uh, get you on your way. Wrestling starts at 8. I hope he's talking about on TV. The coroner is waiting for you in his office. Come see me when you're done. I apologize, Areno, for all the lights being off. We don't stay open as long as you city slick Arenos do at night. Even for a murder? Especially for murder. That makes no sense. Are we authorized to shoot people Arenos? The inscription says, Pelotronics. The brain of our city. A good place to get a drink. Oh. 
だ。Who I'm the Thimbleweed Park Coroner. Welcome to the future. Who? Oh, these are the latest in crime-fighting computers made by Pillowtronics Inc. This is all probably pretty advanced, uh, even for the Fedahoos. Oh, do enlighten us. <laughs> I love your sarcastic humor, Who Agent Ray. It's not humor. <laughs> there you go again. We're interested in any help your computers can give us. They look marvelous. <sighs> yes, happy to explain. So happy to explain who. Yeah, you might want to take notes. Already on it. Tell us about the Bloodtron 3000. This is the Bloodtron 3000. Put two bloody objects in and it will match the blood type, printing out a report to who. Tell us about the Fingertron 3000. Right, Arino, the Fingertron 3000. Insert a fingerprint registry of known criminals and a fingerprint from the murder weapon on fingerprint tape, and it will do a match of who. Oh, tell us about the Facetron 3000. The Facetron 3000. Or, as I like to call it. Let me guess. The Face Areno? <laughs> no, that's what the sheriff calls it. You who city folk who crack me up. Just insert two pictures of an individual and it will verify a positive match. Aren't you the Sheriff Areno? Oh, my, no. <laughs> no, 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 who? Well, people say there is some resemblance around the eyes. But we're as different as peas of who's in a pot of who. Plus, the sheriff has that annoying areno he adds to everything. You'll never hear me doing that, who? Sure. Whatever. Did you use these computers to investigate the pillow factory fire? Oh, sure did. Four computers positively showed the fire was caused by the factory guard. No doubt a who about it. Could the computers have been wrong about the fire? Not these computers. Oh, the state of the art of who computers made by Pillowtronics. Absolutely infallible. Isn't there a conflict of interest with Pillowtronics and the fire? Whoa, now! Pillowtronics and its founder, Chuck, are above reproach. Chuck built this town and was a computer and pillow genius. Are the feds uh, looking into this case? It was solved uh, 20 years ago. No, he's just curious. He's a pillow factory fire buff. He's got a CompuServe chat room and everything. Fascinating stuff. I think we've heard enough. This is all very impressive, sir. This should cut hours of our investigation. <sighs> uh, go see the sheriff in his office for a full explanation of the amazing Arrestron 3000. I have some paperwork to do, a who. Oh, yeah, I almost forgot. Uh, these Tron machines are fully voice activated, so if you need any information, just talk to them. It's like we're living in the futuristic year of 2017. I hate this town. Let's investigate these Tron machines, then go see the sheriff and get out of here. I need to stay focused and solve this murder so I can get on with my plan.
It's a medical skeleton. Please return to Dr. Fred. It's closed. It's empty. It's empty. There's a fingerprint kit here. There's a fingerprint brush, a small amount of fingerprint powder, but it's missing the fingerprint tape. Chewy Caramel Center. Ugh. Awarded to Dr. Mort E. Shun by Sheriff Crook. The primary function of the Blood Drawn 3000 trademark patent pending is to analyze a blood sample and a bloody object to ensure arrest of the suspect. Four. Thirty-two million nine hundred and twenty-one thousand and fifty-six. Eight point one eight five three five two seven seven two. Calculate it. Calculate it. Calculate it. Calculate it. Calculate it. Calculate it. Five. No, wait, seven. Procure a slob or other absorbent material and have some blood on it. Insert a blood sample taken from a body along with a bloody object and I... I mean the blood drawn 3000 trademark will confirm a positive match. Locked off. Yes. One, a robot may not injure a human being or, who in action, allow a human being to come to harm. Two, a robot must obey the orders given it by human beings, except where such orders would conflict with the first law. Three, a robot must protect its own existence as long as such protection does not conflict with the first or second laws. Four, party like it's 1999. It should be. The primary function of the Finger Drawn 3000 trademark is to analyze a fingerprint and find a match in the registry of known criminals and produce a report for the arrest Drawn 3000 trademark. Patent pending. Using official government issue fingerprint tape, place it on an object with fingerprints and the fingerprint will be transferred. It's around here somewhere, I'm not going to solve this whole crime for you, you're probably the kind of person that uses a hint guide, aren't you? Entering hibernation state. One thousand and seventeen miles. The average distance from the Earth to the Sun is ninety-three thousand miles. At its closest orbit, the Sun is ninety-one point four million miles from the Earth. The Andromeda galaxy is around two million light years away. Seriously, you've been playing too many adventure games. The primary function of the Face Drawn 3000 trademark 
is to analyze a photograph of a dead body and compare it with an official photographic ID to provide a positive identification of the victim. The Phase 1 3000 trademark requires official government identification that contains a photograph of the victim. Sure, whatever. Sabuni legs in the It's a speck of dust. It's my speck of dust. Lots of medical books there. I don't want to pick that up. I can't push that. I can't pull that. That doesn't seem to work. I don't want to pick that up. Hello again, Agent Arenos. Hopefully the coroner fills you in on our state-of-the-art Areno computers. That's some very serious computing power you've got there. Yes, sir, Areno. It's all state-of-the-art computer Arenos from Pillowtronics. Absolutely infallible. You're also the coroner, right? Oh, my, no. <laughs> no, 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 Areno. People say there is some resemblance around the eyes, but we're as different as peas Arenos in a pot Areno. Plus, the coroner has that annoying ahoo he adds to everything. <laughs> You'll never hear me doing that, Areno. What else do you know about the Pillow Factory fire 20 years ago? A horrible fire that killed everyone at the factory. After a lengthy investigation and corroborated to Reno by our computers, it was determined the fire was caused by a security guard. Couldn't the fire have been started by faulty equipment? The faulty Reno equipment theory was debunked by our computers. Ironclad Reno evidence pointed to the security guard who was uh, also killed in the fire. The case was closed, and blame squarely and fairly put on the guard of Reno. You, I mean, the coroner, said something about the Arrestron? Yes, the Arrestron 3000. The last step in a fully computerized Reno arrest. The final link in the chain of a guaranteed conviction of Reno. Every detail of Reno analyzed and verified by computer. Moving on. Right. Uh, sorry, Areno. I, I get carried away sometimes. This is the big bad boy Areno you've been hearing about. The Arrestron 3000. Uh, just feed three reports from other Tron machines into this, and it issues a 100% Areno valid arrest warrant. Yeah, these machines are the reason we need only one law enforcement officer Areno. Chuck said that computers will soon put us all out of work, allowing for a full life of luxury. Should we investigate Chuck as a suspect? Sadly, Chuck passed away a few days ago. There was a big service out at the cemetery, Reno. Oh, the entire town showed up, which isn't surprising for the hero of Thimbleweed County. We'll talk more about Chuck later. I need to run a Reno and check on a disturbance call out at the old circus. Probably that stupid clown Areno again. 
Looks like we need to go talk to the rest of the weirdos that live in this town. We should split up. It will be faster. You cooling your heels in the local diner would also make things go faster. If we follow agency questioning protocols, this shouldn't take long. <sighs> Just don't mess anything up. I want to get out of here as fast as possible. Agreed. Life must be understood backward, but it must be lived forward. So rent your ticket. There has to be something. The day rundle. God is not willing to do everything, and thus take away our free will and that share of glory which belongs to us. Nicole Machiavelli. If God did not exist, it would be necessary to invent him. Voltaire. Others go astray in cases where they think they have the most perfect knowledge. Descartes. No man's knowledge here could go beyond his experience. John Locke. The arrest on 3000 trademark S primary function is to take reports from the blood drawn 3000 trademark, the finger drawn 3000 trademark, and the face drawn 3000 trademark, and issue an arrest warrant for the obviously guilty suspect. After the arrest drawn 3000 trademark, generates the arrest warrant, this comeback criminal is arrested, jailed, and toils away making license plates with little chance of release. The job of the detective, agent, or law enforcement personnel is done. Close program. It's my specks of dust. Just a bunch of files. There's a fingerprint book here. This has fingerprints for everyone in Thimbleweed Park. Certified Fingertron 3000 compatible. I can't open that. Just a bunch of files. It's closed. Just a bunch of files. Just a bunch of files. Just a bunch of files. We interrupt our hostile takeover nonstop music with this important message. Special announcement. Pizza meeting tonight. Find Chet for the secret code. And now back to our special hostile takeover song. It doesn't have any buttons. Must be for incoming calls only. <sighs> Is this thing on? Daisy, Daisy, give me your answer, do. I'm half crazy, all for the love of you. A bicycle built for two. Breaker 1-9, Breaker, Breaker. Attention all units. Enough screwing around. I've got a case to solve.
No time to talk. We have to fix this slight leak. What caused the leak? Well, the Hydratron's tube is obviously burned out. We could use a new one. A WC-67? Yeah, we're out of that size. Must have been the signals. Yes, the signals. It's a bag full of plumber tools. The doors are locked, and nobody's inside. It's locked. <laughs> 